Friday, September 16th, we're going on a hike. We just played a practical joke, making Hidari think we weren't taking him. And now I'm going to go get him. Come on, big dog. Come on, in the car. Good boy. Here we are, starting at our point of entry, going up into the mountains. We're up at 9,000 feet. There's the other partner and the other one, four-legged one. Here they go down the mountainside, walking down the trail. That's what happens when you don't watch where you're going. Okay, enough for that. Bye. There's Tracy and the dog. She came out. Any bears? Nope, no bears. Any deer? Bear. You see any bears, dog? Huh? You see any bears? No, I guess not. Okay, we're heading up to a rock formation up here. We'll try to take a video of it in a little bit. Found this little rock formation. As we were going up through the trails, it's kind of off the trail right now. The trail is way back there. And we came way up here. And now Tracy is exploring, along with the dog, up into the rocks. Lots of brush around here, as you can see. No fire damage. So I guess they didn't have much of a fire up here. And there she goes up to the top of that formation there. Okay, I'm going to try to go up myself without killing myself and videoing at the same time. Oh, there I go. Inch by inch, step by step. I'm going up. I'm coming, dog. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Yeah, this is our little mountain on top of the mountain, and we're still not at the summit yet. Oh, we're having a water break. Yeah, we're going to take a little water break now. And that's where we came up from. So sign off now, and we'll take a little water break. On further investigation, we found this man-made lean-to. Uh, actually, you can crawl inside from where Tracy is right there. And it's pretty good sized space inside. Somebody built it a while back. And it goes all the way up to the top of this little. Hi, Tracy. Yeah. And there's a dog looking at her. Okay, here we are, heading up another mountain again. We spotted a marker. It looks like somebody made a marker up here. Uh, let Tracy go off by herself off that side. I'm going to take the easy way. <laughs> Could be a campfire. I don't know. Yeah, it's a marker. Some sort. Somebody made one. Yeah, yeah Tracy just tried to kill herself. She's good. She's okay. Anyway, here we are. There's the view, people. That's just one view right there. GPS says we're at 9,580 feet. 
pretty high. We're gonna go back over here. Tracy says she's got a better view over here. So, let's see what we got here. Oh yeah, there's one of the tallest mountains around, 14,000 feet. You can still see the snow at the top. You notice that there's no trees after a certain point. That's because the oxygen is too thin for them to grow. Right where that, you see that snow cap right there. That's usually where tree line stops. Anything above 10,000 feet, it's real difficult for anything to grow. Even for humans to walk up. Anyway, here she comes back up again. And we're going to try to go back up this one here. Uh, you can't really see it because of the trees, but it does go up a little bit higher. Probably a little bit higher than 9,580. So, we're going to sign off and then we're going to try it again. Well, here we are, coming up to the crest at the top of the mountain. Can't wait to show you the view, so come on Tracy, move on up. We're going to rest up at the top up here. Sorry, I got my fingers in the way. Anyway, here we are, going up here. The dog made it. Let her get up there first. Why don't you walk the other way? The dog is trying to make his way up there with his bad leg. I'm going to try to come up myself without killing myself. I'm watching as I go here. Come on down here. Go down there, Hidari. Good boy. Okay, you, you come over here so we can show them the view. Well, I want him to come over here. Hidari, come on. Over here. Come on. This way. Down here. Come on. Down here. Hey. Hidari, down here. Hey, Daddy. Come on. Down here. Down here. Down here. Lay down. I'm going to come up here. Let me get my bearings here. And sit down. Hey, Dari, stay there. No, stay. Get down there. No, no. Down. No. Go lay down. Stay there. Good boy. All right. Here's the view, people. Show it all the way down. That's the incline we came up. Way over there is where we started. And we are up here very close to 10,000 feet. Those mountains. Nice, huh? And we're just sitting here. We're gonna rest here for a while. It's starting to get a little chilly too. Looks like we got some thunder boomers coming in. But anyway, this is the highest we've been so far by ourselves. Feels good. At my age, yeah, that's an accomplishment. This is up about 9,000 feet, and this is the foliage that is turning for the fall. All around us, wide open fields on this mountain road that we picked to travel down. We've gone about a mile, mile and a half so far. Looks pretty nice. And of course, Tracy's taken off into the woods with the dog. And yeah, there's the dog, no Tracy. Okay, now I gotta go find Tracy. Here comes Tracy down the trail, doing it the way I showed her how to do it, a zigzag pattern. So she doesn't walk straight down and walk into something. Checking out the whole area, and of course there's the dog. That's Hidari. He's doing pretty good today, even with his bad leg. Say hi, Tracy. <laughs> hi, Tracy. And here she comes, walking down through the aspens. Pretty colors. Turning for winter. Fall, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, 
Enjoying the view. And now we move off down the trail.